So let's start off by looking at our concept masking sketch. And here we can see the piece of geometry we're going to be making today. And conceptually, the masking boils down to a few ideas, and one is the exploration of strand to volume, so the transition of how a planar surface becomes part of a volume. It's also a soft jid, which is also part rigid and part soft. And the interior, the inside liner, the interstitial space, becomes just as primary as the exterior, so we're going to uh, spend a little bit of time building that out as well. And so looking at this, the best geometric systems to develop this is going to be using polygon primitives. And that's going to give us a bit of flexibility in our approach, which is it's going to make things a lot easier and it's going to become very helpful once the model becomes more complex. And so since we've identified what the key parts of the model are, if we were to develop a working outline, it would be something along the lines of setting up the reference plane to give us a base proportion that we're going to use to start with. Uh, we're going to create low res uh, polygons and what the, you know, the saddle-like surface, which is at the bottom layer, and then we're going to focus on creating the upper volumes uh, and identify the position of the nested spaces. Then we're going to spend some time cleaning it up, and we're going to extract the geometry to build the inner liner, and we're going to use some blend shapes to uh, make a quick custom pattern for uh, surface articulation. And that will be the process from beginning to end, and this, this is going to provide an overview that we're going to uh, make some more uh, videos that are going to go a bit more in depth uh, into all the specific techniques that we're going to be uh, just tapping into for this video. So let's move on now and begin to work on the model.